Hey guys, and in today's video, let's talk about 5K resolution from the GoPro Hero 9 Black and most importantly, can you really see the difference between 5K and 4K? So in this video, I prepared a small test and I want you to guess which videos were recorded with 5K resolution and which with the 4K resolution. I'll include some sound just like that and I'm gonna write whether it was 4K or 5K. So how many can you guess? Let's find out. So after seeing that, how many did you guess? Half of it, all of them, or none of it? Honestly guys, I could barely see the difference myself because I was editing it and watching it on a 1080p laptop and then I was watching it on television and then once again, I could barely see the difference. So after seeing that it's really hard to guess which one is which, I decided to develop this video to give you even more examples side by side with the extreme close-ups. So it will be simply easier for you to spot the difference and decide for yourself if it's really worth it to upgrade your camera.
All right, guys, so let's summarize it all. Honestly, once again, I couldn't see much of a difference between the two. And even when I was editing this project, and um, sometimes I mistook 4K for 5K and the other way around. Really, the difference is really insignificant. And that being said, I don't think that there is a groundbreaking difference between 5K and 4K resolution. I think that 5K video is really great if you want to frame your shot, perhaps uh, adjust it in post-production, maybe do a little zoom in, zoom out, uh, etc. Other than that, 5K resolution takes a lot of space from your hard drive or your micro SD card and the difference between the two is barely noticeable. At least to me, but once again, I don't have a 5K or 4K monitor, so perhaps that can affect my comparison. Honestly guys, I still prefer to shoot my videos in 4K, simply because of the slow motion capabilities. I can record my videos in 4K60, slow things down, make it look epic, and for that feature alone, I'm going to stick with 4K. If you have an older camera and thinking about upgrading, then I think that the 5K resolution is not groundbreaking and 4K is still just fine. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you liked it and you enjoyed it and you learned something from it. And if you did, then give me a thumb up, subscribe to the channel if you haven't before, smash that notification button so you don't miss my future content and see you guys in the next one. Bye!